Homegrown country homestead. How y'all doing today, friends? Well, I thought I'd bring y'all along today, show you what I was doing, and uh, right now uh, I'm just putting a little stain on my uh, wood side in here on my workshop. It's been uh, months uh, letting it dry out, and we've had a couple of days without rain, and so I decided to go ahead and try to get some moved on there before next rain comes in, and want to show you what it looks like. This particular stain that I'm putting on this uh, side here is called TWP. And this uh, color that I'm using is a pecan uh, color, so I like the way it looks. Uh, it's not too dark and it's not too light. It's, it looks like it's going to be a real nice color when it's dry there. But uh, it's the first time I've used this TWP stain, and I've heard a lot of good things about it, so you know, I thought I'd give it a try. And right over here on my door, I used uh, a mixed oil and diesel fuel together and done this several months back. But I've noticed it's kind of faded out uh, over the couple months. And, uh, so I decided to just go ahead and put some stain on this door. I'm going to put a couple coats on my door and make it a little bit dark in the rest of the side. But uh, they, they, they say the oil and stain, you no know, diesel fuel does good. But you know, I don't want to take no chances. So I just decided to just go ahead and get me some just regular commercial type stain put on it. But uh, I believe in a uh, crunch person can probably use just the oil and diesel fuel and get by with it. I think it, you know, put several coats on it over time. I, I believe it'll probably protect the wood real good though. But uh, this particular wood right here is a southern yellow pine I got from a sawmill. It's like an inch and eighth inch thick, something like that. Some of it even inch and three sixteenths thick. It's a real heavy duty <clears throat> wood siding here. But uh, this give you an idea of uh, that color what it looks like on rough cut sawn um, lumber right there on that uh, yellow pine anyway a lot of times I know when I'm looking try to figure out what something looks like you know there's nothing better than get to see a video where it's showing somebody's uh, used a particular product and, and tell what kind of wood it was and so anybody got any projects gonna be using some rough uh, cut yellow pine lumber this is what that it's going to look like when it's finished there it's still in the drying process but uh, I don't figure it's going to fade out too much more it might just get a little bit lighter in color but I just thought I'd give you all a look see what I was doing today and show you what this uh, stain looks like on this uh, wood side and also I would like to thank all our new subscribers for subscribing to our channel we appreciate y'all coming over to our channel taking a look and welcome everybody and also, I want to thank all of our old uh, subscribers who have been with us for a while. Appreciate y'all uh, hanging with us there and, and watching our channel. And we enjoyed all the comments uh, that y'all leave. And uh, as always, from our family to yours, friends, y'all have a blessed day. We'll see y'all later. Bye bye. I like the way that looks, don't you? Mm hmm. It's good. <laughs>